Dan. Jo. Hello, you gorgeous lot. Hope you're doing well, mentally and physically. Uh, yes, I have had my uh, hair cut. This week it was pancake day, so we're back in the kitchen to do some more cooking. Hopefully it will work this time. Maybe? So let's get on and I'll show you what we're doing. So today we're going to be making a chocolate milk bottle. There's the milk bottle. You'll need one of them, preferably um, empty. Do with the milk what you please. Is there anybody that actually doesn't like milk? I know you get intolerances, but I mean like the actual taste. If you don't like the taste of milk, let me know in the comments. I've got two chocky bars to cover up uh, the brand name. And we've actually got some milk bottles. I'll show you what they are in a bit and what we're doing with them. But first of all, <coughs> we've got to prep the bottle. So first what you've got to do is remove the lid and the label somehow. How are we going to remove this? Oh, it's like a slip-on thing. It's not... Oh, there we go. Next, what we've got to do is we've got to smash this up and melt it. But today I'm going to be melting it differently because if you watched my other video, it didn't work very well. And I'll try to use a bain marie because my uh, bowl was a bit small. So today we're going to be doing it in the microwave. Let me just So now we have the chocolate, I'm going to stick it in, in the microwave. 30 seconds and see what happens. Talk amongst yourselves. Ooh, chocolate. Mmm. It's not even started to melt. Is it done this time? Oh, it's nearly there, isn't it? Look. Another 30 seconds. So now we've got the chocolate, we've got to try and pour it into here. Oh, is it gonna... Go, go, go! Go in there, that's it. I'll try and get it in. Maybe. Get it all in. Come on. Oh, I've got it everywhere. Mm. Mm. Now, what we've got to do is try and coat the inside of this um, but it ain't going too well I'm going to try and coat it so I'm just going to shake it to try and coat every single surface there's a little bit on this side that ain't I think I've got nearly every surface now. The milk bottle sort of expanded. And it's even got in the handle, which is great. It's in there. So I'm just going to shake it up a little bit more. So I'm going to take this and I'm going to stick it in the fridge so it can set and clean up this chocolate. Mmm. Yeah. Let's put, should we put them in the sh on the shelf with the other milk? No, look at that. Looks almost the same. Hi. Right. Now we're now we're going to skip forward to where it's set, which can take I don't know how long. It's that time now, so 
So while that is in the fridge setting, it says it's going to take 20 minutes because I asked Mr. Googs. I'll show you what these these are milk bottles. These are milk bottles. Oh, they're all stuck together. I don't know if you have them in your country, but that's what they are. Look, they're like little milk bottles. Oh, no, they taste like milk. But chewy milk. And the idea is we're going to take these and we're going to put them in the milk bottle that we have made out of chocolate. So we've got milk bottles inside a milk bottle. Oh, yeah. Mm. Got the sugar in them. So here it is pretty solid got to try and get this got to try and get out the carton now oh, which is probably easier said than done I think it's gone off hasn't it how do we get it out of the carton though without breaking it so what I've done is I've got a Stanley knife and I've just cut the plastic a little bit and I'm just trying to get it off hopefully Hopefully it'll come off. So if I can just get it off in bits, it doesn't matter. As long as I can get it off. And hopefully the chocolate doesn't melt while I'm doing it. Oh. Leave it with me. Jump cut! Hello. So the last thing you probably saw was me trying to get the milk bottle off the chocolate. It didn't go well, the chocolate went thick enough and it just crumbled to pieces. But not to fret, look, I've got more chocolate and another pint of milk. So we're going to try again, I'm going to do it in batches this time, like two chocolate bars, let's swirl it around, freeze it, next two, hopefully. And I've got more chocolate than I had last time. We're going to do this, because last time the cakes didn't work out, but this will. So let's get on with it. Right. So I'm just pouring the last couple of chocolate bars in. It's looking super thick, the chocolate inside. So hopefully it shouldn't break now when I take the bottle off. Putting it everywhere again. Oh. Right. Oh my god, that is nearly filled. It's up to about there, the chocolate. If I used another two or four, it would have filled that whole pint. We would have just had a thick pint of chocolate. Let's try and get it around a bit. And then I'm whacking it in the freezer. And just check on it. Oh my lord, so much chocolate in there. Right, I'm going to whack it in the freezer and then we're going to come back to it for about 20 minutes or so and then try and take off the thing again. So I've just got the bad boy out of the freezer. That is solid. The only problem is the chocolate's set over the top so I won't be able to put the milk bottles inside. Oh well, I'll just eat them. Mm. Oh, so I'm going to cut the plastic off again now. So, let's do it. Let's go. Oh, look at that! I've got to be careful with the handle though, because that's quite delicate. Oh my god, that is like solid. Right. Also, be careful with the, with the Stanley knife. I don't cut my fingers open. I'll go down there. Oh, I don't think the handle's... Work too well. Oh, has it? Oh, it might have. It might have. Oh no, it's cracked there now. Jolly tall of it. I don't think the handles. No, the handles come off. Handles are stuck in there. Look. Look, that's worked. That has worked. Look at that chocolate milk bottle. 
if I can get that. Oh, I don't think I can get that handle out. Stick the handle back on. Is it going to stick on? Like that. There you have it, look. Looks just like a pint of milk, doesn't it? But it's chocolate. It's amazing. Handle didn't work too well, but I can't believe it's actually worked. Look, you can even unscrew the lid. But not milk, it's chocolate. Oh. I can't believe it worked. I wonder if I can actually break it in half. Whoa, that is solid! Will it nicely break? Oh, it's nicely breaking. Oh, here we go. It's starting to crack. Oh! Oh, oh. oh look at that! I think I might use too much chocolate that time. Mm. Mm, God. Mm. So I hope you enjoyed that. A chocolate milky bottle. It's supposed to be hollow, but I used a little bit too much chocolate the second time and not enough the first time. Try that home for yourself and see if you can do any better. Go on, see. It's not easy, especially when you're filming yourself. I'm hoping to do another trip soon, so make sure you subscribe and you don't miss it. And take care of yourselves, and I'll talk to you in a bit. I've got to go and eat a load of chocolate now and vomit everywhere. It's a hard life. Take care. <laughs>